I've been asked many times about my fire blanket. This thing has taken a beating. It's almost at the end of its life. This is from Turbo Torch. So I figured instead of me responding to everybody asking which one I'm using, it's the Turbo Torch one. It seems to be holding up pretty good, but it is starting to wear. But what are you gonna do? I mean, you can see right here, starting to almost my finger through, but I think it's perfect for whatever I need it for, and I will replace it because of the side that's worn. I'm going to put this on the other side with the metal there. The other side is still immaculate, no, not compromised at all. And in the end, all I'm trying to do is make sure while I'm sweating this, I don't light this up on fire from too much heat. But I mean, if you need one, the Turbo Torch one is pretty good. Maybe it's in the maybe not. That's actually one of my worst joints I've done in a while. It's pretty sloppy, but as you can see, it held up. One of the things I do like to do when I use these is I like to make them damp before I use them. I don't know if it's good or bad for them, but I figure it can't hurt. This spot here is the only spot I've ever had light up is the stitching right there. So the outer stitching has a chance of lighting up, but the middle part hasn't even when I use it dry. I just figure I might as well dampen it a little to use because might as well protect what I'm working on. Make sure that everything is good. I mean, this one I'm only hitting here, so this doesn't even really matter, but still, anytime I'm working by wood, safety. Well, I start a fire, here it's my house, but other places, it's a customer's house. I don't want to damage a customer's stuff. This one I could be more proud of than the first one. The mirror, but as you've seen, the blanket definitely helps. It's the one by Turbo Torch. So let me know which ones you use because this is something that anybody that works with a torch definitely needs. Peace.